Hey there everyone, this is Danielle, playing another Super Mario Maker 2 viewer level. Haven't done this in a while, um, but I'm doing it now, so that's pretty cool. Uh, so this level comes from Cass, uh, here's the comment that she left, there we go. It was on my previous request video, so yeah. So the code is C82F5BYVF, it will also be in the video title, so easy enough to find. And the level is called the Apple Isle Caves, and it's a Mario World level, and... It looks like it's kind of hard because of the low number of clears compared to the... We'll see how we go. <laughs> Let's go! Okay. Reach the goal of grabbing at least 100 coins. Okay, so that would be why it's hard. You've got to get a lot of coins. Um, let's see. That's a mushroom, that's not a coin. Um, there's a door here. Uh, some comments left at the beginning there. Let's go through this door. Okay, that's the exit, so I have to get back here once I've got everything. Let me see. Here's some coins, let's start grabbing coins, see how we go. Oh no! Oh dear, look at all those X's. People are having trouble with this one, by the looks of things. <laughs> okay, so yeah, I have to bounce off one of these winged guys. There's two of them now. That's interesting. That didn't happen a moment ago. Oh my god. Maybe I can go get a cape and come back. <laughs> Okay, so let's grab these first three coins again, and then let's try going the other way and see if we can find something else and maybe come back to that ten coin later. Oh, come on. That's just rude. Okay, I can see a ten over there, which I want. Ugh. I can see my head, dang it. This is gonna be a hard one. Uh... Yeah... I don't know if there's more than a hundred coins, or if like I need to get every single coin. We'll see how we go. I suppose. Can I go down this pipe? I can! What's down the pipe? Um, there's some spiky fellows. I think they're called spinies? Maybe? I forget if those are spinies or if they're different enemies. Ooh, parachuting mushroom. How tasty. Uh, here we've got a couple of maverick swamps. Oh, come on. That would have been so cool if I hadn't messed it up so badly. Uh, we got munches. Oh dear. <laughs> this is a bit scary. Uh, you cannot have a checkpoint in your level if it's got, a, like, an extra objective, so there will not be any checkpoints in this level. Which is sad. <sighs> Damn it. I was like a quarter of the way there, so I think I can pull this off. No idea whether I need to get every single coin, though. So I guess we'll, we'll see. Um, I wonder if the game gives you like a counter of how many coins your level has when you enable the get certain number of coins thing, because that seems like a useful thing to do in the Maker. I haven't seen whether it does or not. I should play with the Maker some more. I barely used it. Like, I made my little trans rights level, and that's pretty much it. Let's try this again. Dang it! That was no better than last time. <laughs> oh no! This is a hard level, y'all. Uh... 
If it had checkpoints, that would help, but you, you can't have checkpoints if you have a, a clear objective. That's just the rules. Ugh. Okay, we've got something going on up here. Um, can we get through here? Yeah, we can. Ah! This trap. Mm, okay, well, I survived. It's gonna keep spawning hammer bros, though, because of how the pipes work. Ah! Give me that mushroom. Oh my god. Oh, I found a key. By accident. Well, I have two keys now, so that's cool. Ba -da -ba -ba. Are you a shopkeeper or something? Ow. You got coins. That's what I need, so thank you. Uh, I guess I can get these power-ups? Are these power-ups? I think they are. So I can wear this shell on my head, right? Yes. And then I'm guessing the other one I can get into. At the same time. I think I can get both of these. Yeah, there we go. And they respawn, so I can come back and get them again. Or at least the shellmate does, I don't know if the other one does. Okay, I'm still scared of this. Uh, let's give this another try. There we go! That's what I'm talking about. Oh, oh! Oh, okay, yeah, I just used the um, shell as a double jump, basically. Because that's one of the things it can do. Uh... And now I've lost my, my various shells, so I'm probably going to go back over there and, oh my god. Get hit a lot. <laughs> yeah, I can go get them again, as you can see, because they respawn when I go off screen. So finding those two keys was very good. I get where I found the first one. Oh yeah, it was with the hammer bros, that's right. The other one was just an invisible block. There we go. Can I go on this pipe? I can. Give me them coins. Hey, turtle. Goodbye. Okay, I can see a 10 coiner down there, which I would love. I'm a big fan of getting 10 coins. I can see a locked door there to get a feather. I'd love a feather, but I don't have another key. Maybe I should have saved my keys. Didn't know there'd be another power-up room elsewhere. That's okay. Maybe I'll die and need to try again, and then I can check out the, the feather room instead. <laughs> Oh yeah, this this thing. Uh, so it sends out a bunch of these guys, but that's okay because we have this shell now, so I can just pop them. Easy peasy. Okay, we're getting there. 79 out of 100. I think there's probably more than 100, judging from what I've seen so far, but I'm not really sure. We'll see how we go. We'll see how we go. Boop boop. <gasps> Feather. Yes, I love that. Oh, 90. We're getting there. We're getting there. Okay, this looks a bit scary, so I'm guessing there's something good over here. There's a pipe I can go into. There's a little block I can hit, which has another feather, but I can't store that because of how this game works, which is sad. That leads to this room, which looks scary. Um, I think I have all these shells covering my entire body, otherwise I'd be a bit scared. <laughs> Well, I mean, more scared. I am a bit scared. Uh... I can't fit in there because I'm carrying so much stuff. <gasps> Yoshi! Hi, Yoshi! You're in this level. Can I, can I reach you? Oh, oh no, boom, boom. Ah! Ah, my shells! No! 
Leave me alone, boom boom. Ah! Yes, I killed him. I got a key. Oh god, I lost my power ups. <laughs> That was scary. <laughs> uh, are you gonna spit fire? Yes. That's okay. I'm just gonna avoid the fire and just make my way back to the entrance because I have everything I need. I have 110 coins. <sighs> ah! Oh, come on. That's not fair. That's not fair. Alright, well, we're doing the level again. I really wish you could have checkpoints in levels that have an extra challenge, but the game doesn't let you. It actually bans you from placing checkpoints if you set a challenge. And I think if you've already placed checkpoints, it won't let you enable the challenge, probably. Something like that. It's Toadette, it's Toadette, she has a cute dress, and pigtails on her head, and they are cute! Toadette is the main character of this video game. Who's Mario? I've never heard of him. <laughs> I know that that's not the song that's playing, but I was in the mood to sing. So I sang. It's still totally worth going in here. TBH. There we go. Okay, we get another key from just here, if we bop the right spot. There we go. We have two keys. Uh, let me think. I'll take these. Thanks, Mole. I think I want to save one of my keys, but I might get the Shelmet. There we go. I'll hang on to this other key for a moment and see if I can use it for something else. Like that feather from the other room. Pew pew pew. Yep, here's the feather. Give me that feather, yeah! Love to have a cape! Love to hover with my cape that I have, yeah! Oh, come on! Are you serious? Uh, I don't feel like going back to get another shell. Yeah, I think placing enemies just so they're outside a pipe like that, that you have to go through to go to the different area. Before I died back there, that, 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 that was a little mean, in my opinion, as a design choice. Not something I would recommend. Do, 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 do. Just inactivate the stuff, then you won't have flying guys to have to dodge. That is my advice about this video game. <laughs> Even though it only applies in this one level. Boop. Here's the part with the Maverick bombs. I still can't dodge them properly, that's pretty annoying. But I'm pretty cool at playing this game sometimes. Yeah, the chain chomp. Looks like there's a bunch of different stuff to look at around. There's that guy that killed me earlier. I think having an enemy right there is not a good idea. Just because if you come through the pipe and you can't do anything because you're dead already. Before you've made any other decisions. And you couldn't tell that they were going to be there because it's the other side of a pipe. Okay, I have all the coins I need. So, let's see here. Yeah, there's definitely way more than 100 coins here, which is good because it means you can choose your own adventure. Rather than being forced to do everything, which is nice. I like flexibility. I also like touching moles by accident. It's one of my favorite pastimes. Sounds weird, I know, but oh my god. <laughs> 
<sighs> well, let's give it another shot. So the goal is up here at the top. We have to go back to the beginning once we have the coins that we need. It's through that door, to be specific. Jump, 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 start first grade. <laughs> Dang it. Time to jump up in the air, jump up in the start first grade, jump up in your first grades will soar away. I'm sitting at the key. Go back to the key. Oops. Dang it. Well, I'm still big, so that's something. I'm still being up. Yeah, I'm the flower. Cool. Grab a second key. There we go. Here's the shop. Let's get ourselves a, a boat instead. An upside down shell, basically. A shell pants? Instead of a helmet? Shell pants? Oops. I'll go through the door again. There we go. It's like Karibo shoe, but it's not a shoe. It's a shell, but it's just Karibo shoe. They did didn't put in this game mode. So they use this thing instead. Works the same as Karibo shoe, but it looks different. <laughs> I like to sing when I play this video game, I hope that's okay. I lost my shell, that's pretty annoying. And I took another hit because I'm bad at video games. Time to slide down here and grab another shell. There we go. Okay, we're 54 out of 100, we're making good progress. Now let's go get the feather, because it's just this way. I believe it's through this pipe here. Yes. Let's get caped up. Glide in time. That's what I'm talking about. Love to glide. What's this? That's a, um, that thing. Flower. Don't want a flower. I'm happy with this cape. <laughs> 61 out of 100. We're making good progress. Gotta watch out for the bad guys over here. Bob them with your shell by jumping on the heads. Then grab the ten coins at 75. As you can see, we're nearly there. Ba -da -ba -ba -ba. <laughs> 79 is a good number to have. But we want a hundred, so let's keep looking. This is the Murray World theme that I am singing to. Don't know if you could tell, I don't know if I'm in tune or fade or key or whatever it's called, that thing that you have to do. <laughs> hmm. Okay, well I lost my shell, but I got the thing, so that's okay. Okay, I have all of them now. That's pretty exciting. Uh, hang on, what's over here? I don't think I've been this way yet. <gasps> Another key! So there's a bunch of keys for getting different power-ups and stuff all over the place, which is kind of cool. It's also the one you get for fighting that big giant boom boom. Which I may or may not do in this run. I don't know. Uh, what's in, what does this door lead to? Uh, that room there, which contains a flower and some other stuff? This is really hard to do with a cape, by the way. <laughs> okay, we'll do it without a cape. <laughs> Much easier this way, because when you're holding the button, you don't float down slow. Okay, so there's a bunch of extra stuff to get there if you want it, so that's kind of cool. Uh, let's not get ourselves killed, because we want to exit the level without being dead. Uh, I said without being dead, Mario. 
You're not Mario, you're Toad Out, what am I talking about? Uh, okay, yeah, I've been here before. Uh, oh my god. Oh my god, give me a mushroom, please. Thank you. Uh, can I go into this part? Yes. Basically, I want to go back to the entrance now, which I think is this direction. Yeah. Yeah, it is. Because of this level's verticality, I'm not sure the little pointer to where you're supposed to go is that helpful. I'm not sure if that's even a pointer to where you're supposed to go, or just like a, a constantly positioned flag, but whatever. Okay, so yeah, we've done the level, let's... Whip. Doesn't go be a whip. There we go. Yeah, I was really impressed. This is a great level. Uh, I might just give it another look just because I want to try something out here. Oh, uh, you may have noticed behind the goal is actually a pipe. I want to see if that goes anywhere. Uh, the answer is no, you can't go in this pipe. But there's a key back here. <laughs> so you can get one of the keys by trying to go in that pipe and then jumping around a little bit. Um, so you can get power-ups that way, which is cool. Um, so yeah, it's it's just a really in-depth kind of level. There's just stuff all over the place. And I think that's pretty cool. And yeah, there's definitely way more than 100 coins here. So you don't have to do everything. You can just try the things you want to try and... Explore around, and these keys are a really great idea, because the keys unlock different power-ups. And so you can try to hunt them out to get the stuff you want, but they usually don't guard coins, except that one with the, um, with the flower and the wiggler. Which does guard some coins, but you know. Overall, it's mostly not necessary to get any keys. I'm pretty sure it's not required to get any keys in order to get all the coins you need. In fact, yeah, I know, I know it is. I know it's not required because I got a hundred before without going into the room and eight keys. So yeah. <laughs> oh my god. Anyway, uh, yeah, I really like this level. I am impressed. This is very good. And this whole key mechanic is super neat, and I'm really impressed with that too. And having this little shop here. I, I like I like having little shops in Mario Maker levels. I think it's a cute idea. And this one's really good because it's so simple, easy to use. Get them all here. You can kill them all and rob the cash register. Big A do crimes. Wonderful. <laughs> so thank you for making this, Cass. It's really good. Thanks for letting me know that you wanted me to play it. Thanks for, you know, having a level that was good that I got to play because I enjoyed it. And thank you. Oh, I'm going this pipe. Where does this go? Oh, that's why moles come out of here because there's moles in here. <laughs> goes to the mole. It goes to the world of moles. Of course it does. Oh my god, look at that comment. Free him. <laughs> Can we? Can I get up there and actually, like, free that guy? Or at least, you know, pop him on the head to defeat him? No, he's trapped. Free him! <laughs> oh my gosh, this level. I like this level a lot. Um, thanks so much for make, it's really good. Oh my goodness, yeah, I really enjoyed this, even if it took me a few tries, because it is kind of hard, but it's also super fun, so that's okay. Oops. <laughs> Wasn't quite what I had in mind. Uh... So yeah, um, good level. Um, check it out if you want, the code is in the video title, and I'll also read it out again, it's C82F5BYVF, and it's this massive cave level that you got to explore all these different rooms and stuff and it's super cool and there's a hidden thing there there's a bunch of hidden stuff and i'm really impressed and i probably didn't find all the secrets because there's a lot of them uh so yeah check this level out i reckon if you are watching my video and you'd like to play mario maker levels that are real cool because this is one of them i would say uh how do you get that 10 coin oh you must need to use the cape to fly up there that's clever i like that so, yeah, some of the money is guarded by the power-ups in a way that means you actually absolutely need power-ups, but a lot of it isn't. Pretty sure all the power-ups are optional, which is cool. They are, however, very helpful. <laughs> and yeah, burning enemies with, with um, fire doesn't give you coins in this game, I believe, so you don't actually need to use fire flowers for any of this either. It does in the original Mario world when you burn enemies into coins. For some reason. 
anyway, thanks for watching, I hope you enjoyed, and I enjoyed this level, and I would recommend playing it, because it's real good. Why would I want to hear about Mario's moves? I'm playing as Toadette. God.